fact, it doesn't much matter what you say on the telephone. The telephone as a service is a huge environment. And that is the medium. And the environment affects everybody. What you say on the telephone affects very few. And the same with radio or any other medium. What you print is nothing compared to the effect of the printed word. The printed word sets up a paradigm, a structure of awareness which affects everybody in very, very drastic ways and it doesn't very much matter what you print as long as you go on with that form of activity. Now, literacy had uh, very strange antecedents, very strange effects on people and uh, we're only beginning to notice what those effects were now that it tends to be pushed aside. Uh, the, uh, Literacy uh, as a form of awareness is a highly specialist and objective sort of thing. You stand back and the literate man can stand back objectively and look at situations. The TV person has no objectivity at all. It tends to uh, create a totally different kind of awareness, which is rather that of involvement. Literacy is objective. The TV is subjective, totally involved. I personally have avoided making value judgments because an end to that. I've long ago discovered that value judgments are so personal that it confuses people enormously. Yes, but that's, that is a kind of value judgment itself, isn't it? And not of a medium, but of people. And uh, people are very diversified. It's long, it's been known for a long time that uh, a reader. For example, the word read, to read, means to guess. Look it up in the big dictionary. The word radon means to guess, and reading is actually an activity of rapid guessing. Because any word, any word has so many meanings, including the word reading, many, many meanings, that to select one in a context of other words requires very rapid guessing. That's why a good reader tends to be a very quick decision maker. And a, a good reader, a highly literate person, tends to be a good executive. Because he has to make decisions very fast while reading. Uh, and so the, the very nature of reading uh, calls for quick decisions and guessing. And uh, the, uh, the, that's what the word means, to guess.